Welcome back to the Headbangers Ball. Ricky Rackman here. And of course, it doesn't take long to figure out that our guests on the Headbangers Ball tonight are... Ah! Pearl Jam. <laughs> no, it's Guar. Odorous Youngers and Slymenstra Hyman. And I was able to attend the wonderful Guar show in Los Angeles with the Dickies about three weeks ago. And uh, before the show, you let some of the wonderful Guar fans come up and just prove what a... Uh, how stupid they really exactly. are, basically, yes. And when I was there, one it's guy set his hair on fire. fire, and what are some of the other things that, that the typical Guar fans will do before a Guar show, just to be on stage? Mutilate their genitals, uh, kill postmen, uh, slaughter the family pets, and bring them in a nice, tasty souffle down to the show. It's all a big thing, so we can get uh, victims for our world maggot, which crashes up out of the stage at the end of the set and devours the entire studio audience. And these are types of the things that, what can a Guar person that's never been to a Guar show look forward to. Because mm. there are some people Being out there that have never the seen... world maggot this year, you see, we are trying to get home to our home worlds. Yes, we're trying to escape your miserable planet once and for all. I think the average uh, person who hasn't seen Guar before and comes to one of our cannibalistic mutilation blood orgies can expect uh, defilement, debasement, debauchery, and of course a deli tray afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> and I know a lot of people, we're going to play your video, Jack the Wolf, a little oh, bit. Oh, And goody. a lot of people are real curious if they're planning the Guar Unplugged record soon? Is that coming out? Well, that's all the few people here at MDV. I mean, this is the only show that's got the guts to have Guar on it. Guar Unplugged. It's going to be great. <laughs> we'll be back with more Guar and Headbangers Ball. Stick around. <laughs> Always politically correct and social conscious, we have Guar as our guest on uh, Headbangers Ball tonight. Now, what are some of the issues that we... Uh, hit on this Toilet Earth, which is the new Guar record. Let me see that. What is that thing, anyway? Oh, oh yeah, this is well, the title is our green statement. Yes, toilet the Toilet earth. earth. You continue to use your Earth as a big toilet. It won't be very long until it's just a, a glowing husk, a cinder in space, as it were. Uh, useless to your race. Uh, very useful to us, though. We will be destroying the planet entirely and escaping to outer space once and for all. You think I'm pretty deluded, don't you? No, we, lo we lo actually, this makes more sense than the last couple of guests we've had on the ball. Yeah, I think so. Now, what about the... Uh, Movie. I heard some sort of Guar movie coming out. Yes. Oh, yes, we are movie stars now. Big film stars. A million dollar budget. Just got back from Cannes, and it was really wonderful. Yeah. Uh, billions, zillions of dollars. New album rocketing up the chart, rocketing off the charts, actually. Uh, yes, the movie's called Skullhead Face. Uh, we're supposed to release it sometime. It got a great review in Film Thread about a year ago. I don't know. It's in the can, as they say, which is kind of where I need to be right about now. And also, there's home videos out for people that haven't, that won't, might not be able to get to a Guar show. Right? Yes, yes, but it's really a pale imitation of what the, you know, a true sadistic cannibalistic death orgy is. And you guys out there know what that's about, don't you? So go see Guar. They're on the road now, and the record is called This Toilet Earth. Nothing we'll be looking is like for the, the movie. real thing. Coming to a theater or drive-in near you. Buy all our stuff and then go. On the way, videos from Biohazard Cannibal Corpse when the Headbangers Ball continues. <laughs>